Hello everyone, welcome back to this episode of Dual Crossbows Dark Souls 3. It's uh, been quite a while since I recorded an episode on my side. I uh, took a bit of time off to do a bunch of the uploading required to get the series up. So, yeah, there was a lot I have not... Uh, there was a lot, of, a lot of time there when I was playing other things. But I'm well, back now. That at last, knows thou the name Anri of Astora? The brave lad left this. Okay. Though gave no elusive so... Anyway, now, so see done he, that. he would... You're probably wondering why I'm wearing painted guardian armor, and why I probably have quite a lot of souls compared to where I left off last time, which is probably me getting my ass kicked by Aldrich. Uh, because I'd taken a bit of time off the game, I did a bit of farming. Tried to make sure I remember where all the buttons are. And I spent a bunch of the souls to get a whole lot of arrows too, so we're pretty full of ammunition at the moment. Also, I had a chance to review the situation because I really did get stuck at Aldrich. Like, that was... It wasn't impossible, but like it was, it was fatiguing enough that I was like, I gotta really reassess where I am in this game and in this challenge. And uh, I realized that this is just a habit I have, but like level 30, I didn't make it a rule in this challenge that I was not going to level up. And five of those points were the free luck points. Like I'm. I would I would halve that those luck points as levels go and say I'm about level 28, trying to fight Aldridge. That's you know if you're doing a level four ch uh, level four challenge, if you're doing a, a level one challenge, that's one thing. But like I'm doing a crossbow challenge, I shouldn't really be going out of my way to make my life harder based on my level. Oh, hello, so you're back. If, no, if and it gets one. really bad, I should level up. I do feel like I want to spend some of these souls on... Good this <laughs> ...some of the equipment, though. I guess I just don't get a lot of spare souls. Uh, what was the other thing that happened? Oh, yes, I took a black fireball up ah, to the crows. Is good and one I leveled me. up one of my crossbows to plus seven. And sorry if I'm rambling on, but I've got a my lot to catch up my. on here. Seems like ages passed. I imagine it's passing. I miss you. My thanks. I'll be. It's. <laughs> no real point to the call, but I'll keep it anyway. Uh, yeah, I was doing a, and I was doing a bunch of co-op sessions in this in as a painting guardian with dual crossbows, and it's kind of a cool look. Like I ended up liking it a lot more than I thought I would. Uh, what else is it? I was doing my farming outside the Deacons of the Deep area, so I got a full set of Cathedral Knight armor, which is cool. So now, the if I can just get over my rambling, uh, I either spend souls on lightning bolts or I spend souls leveling up. Welcome home, Ashen. Speak thine. Very well. Then touch the darkness. I had a chance to review a lot of my progress, as I said, and there aren't any titanite chunks worth a damn on the way down to Yorm the Giant, which was kind of shocking. I thought that was actually a thing, but it isn't. <laughs> So it only takes 5,000, well, well 6,000 ish souls per level still. Like, I've got a lot of. What uh, do I need to level up there? Strength and dexterity, intelligence and faith, and, and luck to a certain degree are all fairly lackluster stats. I'm guessing just vitality and endurance and vigor to a certain degree. Level 34? Sure. If I was done with my dark room, uh, quest line, I could go take a pale tongue and reallocate my stats and put those five levels of uh, luck into something better, but until that happens, I guess we'll go with this. Now the question is, do I want to take another crack at Aldrich? You know what, it has been a long time 
since I have been... It's been a long time since the last episode. I don't even really remember Eldritch very well in my first attempt. All my subsequent attempts, so... Perhaps we'll give this a go and we'll see just how bad it is, still is. I don't expect I'll win this, but... We'll give it a good old-fashioned try, shall we? I've got to remember to put on my good bolts, I guess. Should I try my lightning bolts or my heavy bolts? I'll go with the heavy bolts as the standard and the lightning as the alternate. alternate. The lightning attacks didn't do very much last time. The painting... Ah, oh, I just realised that I have quite a few problems here. The knights are not the worst of it. They are fairly bad. Oh. Oh crap. Yeah, that wasn't very good. This is a bad start. <laughs> I wasn't I wasn't gonna worry too much about my armor, but I really should worry about my rings. Because I was gonna run all the way to the boss room just running past things, I got severely confused. But this is not a bad time to take stock of the situation. Make sure I still know how to play. It's entirely possible I'll be playing better than usual because won't be affected by all the bad habits that I picked up earlier. I mean, that wasn't bad. And what's my weight limit like? Really? Uh, it's not quite under 30. I could do better. But I really need the fire ring, don't I? I wonder if I could shed a pound here or there. Mm. It's really hard to get your weight limit under that a pound, but no, nah, that'll do. Not quite as sexy, but <laughs> it'll do. And if I can remember correctly, I just hug the wall over here. And run at the door. All the waiting fireballs. Yep, made it. And we instantly get Devourer of the Guards. Aren't too bad. I really have to 
somehow get hit there. Reload both. Putting in. Nope. Another corner. Yeah, walking behind him is not going to pop here. That was luck. Certainly didn't do that deliberately. Or that. Now all the fun of this. Nope. Nope. Somehow still here. Oh crap. That was lucky. I really need to avoid those melee attacks because they're the only times I really have a free shot. The rest of the time, they're just beating the crap out of me. Got it that time. Some unbelievable level of skill there, it wasn't gonna happen. Okay, I kind of get it. I don't feel like it's undoable, it's just hard. <laughs> really gotta do better on those, uh, on those dodges. Okay. Lightning bolts were okay, but not really. Fabulous, but I think we already established that the last time. And they're kind of expensive, so... Probably shouldn't waste my time with them. Okay, now's a good time to make a run for it. Let's see if I can make another dash. feeling that you're being chased. <laughs> well, at least I could I could still do the boss room run. Oh crap. Oh wow. That was not Let me waste them all on his second form. 
Wow, that's a good time to do a video clip, huh? <laughs> oh crap. I'm gonna deal with this too. Oh, whoa, okay. Really not worth re-recording re that, huh? <laughs> Got to win the damage race somehow. It's pretty hard when he pulls out all the magic attacks that you can't. It's very hard to dodge all of them. Let's just say. While you're trying to reload and fire, <laughs> it's not easy. I just. At the same time, I'm, I just don't feel like I can't do it. I just feel like I have to get the right, that, you know, that magic, uh... Oh, crap. It shows very poorly just then. Still somehow made it. Rolled into that guy just to piss him off. I feel like I'm, I'm just, like any second, I could beat this guy. I can just do it correctly. Let's get that part down. Oh crap, yeah, backing away from him there doesn't really achieve anything now. Worth a go. Where did he? No. Unusual corner for him to pick. His first stage arrow attack is so easy to deal with if you're paying attention. It's just that second phase. You really have to make the most of this here. Oh, 
Did I get it? Ah! Nice! <laughs> I thought it would take one more hit. But it seems like he fell down, eventually. <sighs> okay. There you go! I can do it. I just have to actually be good at the fight. I'm afraid... Most of the time, this fight, I just run in and burst him down with a, with a big sword or something. Drawing out the fight, he's actually... You know, it takes a bit of management. I'll say that much. But it looks like we're done! That's a, that's a good, uh, a good way to start a comeback, as it were. <laughs> Just a couple of levels and we're all on our way. Sun Princess Ring. And that's about it for Anna Wanda. There isn't really much reason for us to stick around here right now. So now, I guess we're going to the Forsaken Capital. Because... I briefly considered going, like, if we got really... really badly stuck, we could maybe fight the Dancer early. Because I feel like the Dancer might be one of those... strange fights where the crossbows will actually make it easier than fighting her conventionally. But, you know, it's hard to say. Could be the case, it could uh, be totally wrong. Don't really know why I'm picking on these three. I think it's because when I was farming human dregs on another character, I just got in the habit of coming down here and killing them when I'm not... not really thinking about what I'm doing. Just pure muscle memory brought me there. Okay, let's let's not waste time with this. All right, I will probably merge those two recordings together and make one episode. So I'll see you again on the next episode. Bye for now.